So what is the digestive system and how is it organized? Well, the purpose of the digestive system is digestion, to break down food into smaller pieces for use by all cells in the body. So the digestive system is broken down into two major parts, the alimentary canal and the accessory organs. All of this is controlled centrally by the brain. The alimentary canal consists of any part of the digestive tract that acts as a hollow tube whose organ's purpose is just to move food through it and possibly to churn it up a little bit on its way. From end to end, from mouth to anus, the alimentary canal can be as long as four times your height and it consists of the mouth, the esophagus, stomach, small and large intestines, and then, of course, the rectum in, near the anus, in that order. Like anything in life, it's helpful to have a few friends around. The friends of the digestive system are mostly part of the endocrine system and are sometimes composed of glands. Um, and they include... Um, organs like the liver, the pancreas, the gallbladder, salivary glands, and other organs such as the teeth and the tongue also help with digestion. Without these special organs, digestion would be harbored. These two major parts of the digestive system, the alimentary canal and the accessory organs, help forward six major digestive processes. The first process is ingestion, basically means bringing food into the digestive tract through the mouth. And another process is involved in digestion is called peristalsis, which is this wave-like movement of food through the alimentary canal. Mechanical and chemical digestion is yet another process of the digestive tract. The key here is that there are two major ways how food is broken down. More on that in other videos. Secretion, or enzyme secretion, is another important process. Secretion involves the release of enzymes um, into the digestive tract uh, from these organs to help with breaking down food into smaller pieces. Nutrient absorption is basically the movement of food molecules from the tract, the digestive tract, into the blood. And finally, elimination or defecation is the process of eliminating waste from the system. In other videos, we'll break down the major structures and organs of the digestive system to determine their individual function and importance in the grand scheme.